watch all the 2020 Oscar nominee animations at the Crest Theater. Here to tell us more is General Manager of the Crest Theater, Robert Alvis. Hi, Robert. How's it going? Now, what made you guys want to open your doors and show these animated shorts? Well, the Crest has a long uh, history of uh, showing these shorts every year. So um, this year was no different, although it's a much more condensed time period. Mm -hmm. uh, the Oscars were moved up a couple weeks, so we only have a very brief window where we were allowed to show them. So we, we made sure we maximized that by showing them three days in a row. Oh, nice. There's a little bit of tradition there. Obviously, the Oscars is a huge tradition, and um, a lot of film buffs love to take you know, part of the action and get in on it. So this is a great way to see some of those films. Let's talk about the animated films that you're featuring. Uh, let's start with Hair Love. Hair Love is a, uh, it's a short about How a cute. man, <laughs> about a man who is uh, doing his uh, daughter's hair for the very first time. Oh my goodness. And uh, as you can imagine, there are uh, some pitfalls in that. Uh, and he, but he makes it through, and I'm not going to give the story away, but he, he accomplishes it in, very the, in cute. the end. And this is one of the animated films. Why do you think people are loving this one? Um, this one's very relatable. Um, you know, for someone like me, I don't have any children, but I can, there's, you still can, uh, uh, it still resonates with you because there are things in there that are totally relatable to taking on new tasks that you've never done before. Yeah, I can imagine some of the guys I know doing hair for the first <laughs> time. It could be a little bit challenging. Now, another Oscar-nominated short is called Sister. Tell yes. me about that one. Um, Sister is, uh, it's so simple, um, and that's that's kind of the beauty, beauty of that, is uh, it's, a, it's the shortest of the shorts. It's uh, black and white, it's six minutes long. Um, it's out of China. Um, but I, but I really liked it because uh, its beauty is in the simplicity. Okay. Um, uh, it, the animation uh, is is uh, dolls almost like a like felt dolls. Yeah, we can see it right there. Uh, okay. Yeah. So um, yeah. So it, it's it's very simple. It's uh, and it and it hits you really hard mm -hmm. in, in the heart at the end. So. Oh. Okay. Don't yes. give it away. No. Nope, nope. I'm, I'm trying I'm not to. I'm sensing there's like a family <laughs> theme going on here because there's. Another one called Daughter. Yes, very much so. So yeah, this year most of the shorts uh, have uh, deal with family dynamics. Okay. Um, daughter is a is about a father and a daughter, and she's reliving a time when she was a kid, and she found a bird that was dying, um, and she showed it to her father, and now her father is dying, and it's it's running parallel. Time. And for people that aren't familiar, animated shorts, that's what they are, they're short. Yes. So so these films are like average. Uh, yeah, yeah, the, the longest one is 15 minutes, the shortest one is six. Right. Um, so uh, you so can learn a The storyline moves of along pretty quickly. Pretty quickly, <laughs> and, and they try to fit as much as they can into a very small space. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, that, that sounds fun. Let's keep going with what, what's being featured, Memorable. Memorable is, uh, is about a man whose uh, life is slowly uh, disintegrating in front of him, so um, it's, it's mostly like clay animation, um, and as the story goes along, uh, everything starts to disintegrate more wow, and more. Wow, look at more. the detail in that. Yes. That's pretty amazing. Okay, we don't want to leave out animals because there's an animal one, Kit Bull. Yes, Kit Bull is uh, Pixar's uh, uh, short this, this year. It's not in the normal Pixar uh, thing. It's about a uh, street cat. So kitten, a, okay, yes, got that yeah, part. Yeah, a kit part, and a mistreated pit bull. Um, kind of a familiar theme with uh, pit bulls is that a lot of them are mistreated and um, stories of how to uh, to break that uh, worry about them being mean and tough kind of and, stereotype and, 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 and all just that. want to be loved like any other dog. Very cute. Oh, these are really interesting. So when are you guys going to be airing these? So we're going to be airing them February 2nd, 3rd and 4th. And we're doing uh, all three programs, animated, live action and documentary all three And days. so you can sit down one sitting what catch all of the animated shorts plus a few more correct yes they show uh, a few animated shorts that were considered but didn't make it into the nominations as all right well. and if someone wants to check this out do they need to get a ticket ahead of time you don't have to get a ticket ahead of time you can get them right at the door um, the box office opens an hour before the movie starts oh this sounds like a lot of fun do you have a favorite you can tell me what your favorite one was um my favorite is sister um and uh, i don't know and so we'll see that's we'll one, see if that comes up the big winner most. yes all right. Thanks for being here. That's great. This sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah, thanks Over for having there at the me. Crest Theater. For more information, visit CrestSacramento.com. This interview involves commercial content. The products and services featured appear as paid advertising.